Hey everyone, we are here on the carpet with Max Schneider. Um, I know the Grammys haven't happened for us yet. We haven't seen it West Coast, but uh, when are you going to go on that stage? When are you going to perform at the Grammys? Oh, if I were ever, ever, I were blessed to do, I would, I would be so excited. I mean, whenever, whenever it's possible, would be awesome. But um, it's just, it's just incredible to, to see so many people who deserve to win getting up there and being nominated, and, and amazing artists like you know Sia. I think such a wonderful artist and amazing music coming out from, from her, and, and it's just awesome. So you know, if I were ever to, to grace that stage, I would be really, really honored. Was there anybody tonight, any of the performances tonight, that you were like, oh my god, I have to see it, I can't wait to see it? Oh my gosh, well, I, I know that Ed Sheeran's doing some stuff tonight, I love him, and, and uh, really everybody, I mean, I, I know there's just so many performances coming, and, and uh, yeah. Well, I know, let's talk about you musically, I know like you've been cooking it up in the kitchen, what can we expect music-wise, and where are we going to get some of that? Yeah, yeah, so i got some music coming out in March, a lot of it, I've got a, I've got a project with uh, Tim Armstrong from the band Rancid, uh, it's called Wichita, it's an old soul project we're doing together, it comes out March 10th, and then uh, March 22nd, the big, uh, the big pop single comes out, and I'm really excited for that, we've been working on it for a while, it's got a crazy video we're working on, and, and all that good stuff, and then this summer, uh, I did a, a movie about the Beach Boys called Love and Mercy, and nice. um, it's got a great cast, Paul Dano, uh, John Cusack, Paul Giamatti, and Elizabeth Banks. And uh, it's about Brian Wilson's life, and, and it's a really wonderful film, and I'm excited for everybody to see it. It comes out June 6th. Real quick, give us your favorite emoji to describe the first single. How is the first single going to make people oh feel? Gosh, favorite emoji. Well, I love the monkey emoji, so just like the monkey emoji that's like... So that's how know, they're going to feel after I that hope, That's what I hope they feel, yeah. you know. Um, or just there's the other monkey emoji that's just like... So I hope they don't feel that. But if they do this one, I'll be fine. I'll be fine. Last question. Uh, Valentine's Day is coming up. What's something creative somebody can take their girl or guy out for Valentine's oh, Day? Oh, totally. Um, I love doing crazy things with my girlfriend. We love trying new experiences. Uh, we're going on a hot air balloon this year wow. for Valentine's Day, which I've never done before. We went out skydiving for her birthday in September. I just think that, you know, make it grand. Make it, make it memorable. You only got one life. So. Absolutely. Yeah. All right, you guys, make sure you're checking out uh, Max's single coming out in March. It's going to be a big year for you, and we'll see you here. Next year, you'll come back here, but with a Grammy. I hope so. Thank you very much. Man. Right, I appreciate thanks, it. Buddy.